does that compare to current console hardware? Uh, the, the performance there? The technology on your servers. There. Oh, it's far and beyond. Um, it's not just higher performance in terms of uh, graphics capability, but we have higher performance in terms of, for example, the, uh, the disk drives, the networks, and so forth that interconnect them. I mean, you saw how many polygons are making up that face? So we're able to have the data that's coming in for showing you know, what her face looks like at different points in the animation actually streaming into a server. Um, there's other things. We can build in dedicated hardware for doing ray tracing. You know, the, the glassiness that you see in her eyes, okay, that's done with ray tracing. Uh, you may have seen a test video that we did um, together with Warner Brothers, it's one of our investors, for uh, Batman Arkham City, the Hugo Strange trailer. It's fantastic. There's about three million views on YouTube if you haven't seen it. And that is using MOBA technology as well. And so you can see the, um, um, how the faces in that trailer, and it's a video game trailer, like, oh my god, this looks like live action. It isn't live action. It's all computer generated. What you're seeing there is a preview of the kind of video game that's going to be the standard sort of video game that you see on online. We're going to be blurring the boundaries between cinema and video games. How soon do you think uh, users might start seeing games like that on online? Um, the first thing you're going to see are what I'd probably call a gamelet or a, uh, you know, um, you know, a short form game, which are going to be like tests because they, they, you know, this is all new territory. They're not sure how people are going to react to it. Uh, they're not exactly sure how to market them ex exactly, what kind of ways they're going to use the technology. So, you know, they may be 15 minutes, 30 minutes long, that sort of thing. Um, some things are being developed that are tied in with motion pictures, uh, where, I mean, literally, the characters in the video game and the characters in the motion picture will look identical. And unless you're an expert in computer graphics, you're going to think that it's live action. So, you know, the, the sort of things that, uh, that are coming are just, uh, you know, just mind-blowing. It's going to change the whole nature of gaming.